Hi everyone! In this video, we're going to discuss using Tailwind CSS in a React application. Tailwind is a CSS library in a similar space to things like Bootstrap or Bulma. However, Tailwind is different, that instead of providing CSS for full components, it provides low-level utility classes. What this means is that instead of using class equals button or class equals card or something else, you'll define your own button by composing Tailwind's utility classes. For an example, we'll look at some HTML of a card created with Bootstrap next to a card created with Tailwind. On the left is the Bootstrap card, where the right is a card created with Tailwind. At first glance, you'll notice that the Tailwind card is more verbose, but we make up for that with a bit more flexibility. Now we can adjust how our component looks by changing the utility classes that we're using. I use React quite a lot and appreciate libraries like Emotion and Styled Components. Thankfully, we can use Tailwind in conjunction with these tools, achieving some very nice component-based results. We're going to start with a default Create React App project. We'll add Tailwind.macro at Next and Tailwind CSS using Yarn or NPM. As of the time of this recording, using Tailwind macro at Next is very important is there are some extra steps that would need to occur if we weren't using the release tagged with next. After this, we'll add Emotion Core and Emotion Styled. If you prefer Styled Components, you can add that instead of the Emotion Packages. The implementation is roughly the same. We're ready to start writing some code. We'll start by navigating to the default app.js. We'll delete all the code except for the first line where we import React. Next, we'll import styled from emotion slash styled and tw from tailwind.macro. We'll create a new style component named button and use our tailwind macro. You'll notice how we're adding the tw expression inside the style component template literal. tw, like style components, uses a template literal with the tailwind utility class that we'd like to use. For this example, we're creating a button with padding, rounded corners, different font size, as well as a couple other properties. We can go ahead and create a default export that uses this component and run our application to see it in action. Using Tailwind with React and Emotion or Style components has been extremely useful for me. I hope you find it helpful also. Please find me on Twitter at Ryan Lancio and let me know what you think. Thanks.